So I came home to a couple of boxes on my front porch and anytime you have a box with this label, you know it's gonna be something good. Let's get this one opened up first. I presume it's gonna be some kind of ammunition. Let's take a look. Weird that it has that logo. All right, let's take a peek. Global Ordnance, little ammo can. And maybe we should put the cardboard underneath so the wife doesn't get mad at me here. But we can take a peek. We can see we got an ammo can. The cool thing is it's got this little tie on it, this little uh, lock, however you want to say it. Let's cut that off. Let's see what we have here, guys. It looks like we have these uh, two, I guess they're speed loaders, two little plastic speed loaders. Let's set those off to the sides. And we have this uh, 300 round, looks like sealed lot of 5.56. We have these bags. I have three of these bags. I presume there's one bag for each box of 300 rounds. At any rate, let's get one of these open, just like if you had a paper route when you were a kid, right? Pop this thing off. Let's set that to the side. And let's take a look at what we have in here, guys. And this is actually some really nice uh, brass cased uh, ammunition, obviously blank ammunition, good looking stuff. It's all uh, sealed, it's all on stripper clips, really good looking stuff. It's packaged in boxes of 300 rounds. It's all sealed, pretty impressed with this, but obviously this is only part of what came in the mail. Let me see what else came in the mail. Let's get this out of the way, and then what in the world is this? Let's get this one popped open and see what we got here. Now, if you don't notice here, or maybe you didn't notice, I'm using this little Civivi knife. No uh, affiliation with Civivi. I just really like this little knife. I think it's a badass little knife. At any rate, the first thing I pop out of here is this weird black tubular thing. This thing's pretty long. It's just hollow. There's no rifling, nothing like that. It's just this hollow tube. It's got a step down in there, about maybe four inches down in there. Hmm, interesting. Let's set this off to the side. Let's see what else is in here. I'm going to look through all the pieces of paper. This is just to make sure there's no pins or anything in here. It looks like this is going to be the business end of what they shipped me. Let's take a look here, guys. And here it is. I am not going to lie to you. You might be able to hear me in the recording here. I am laughing pretty hard as I unbox this. This is crazy looking. So if you haven't been able to tell what this is, this is a can launcher and it is a golf ball launcher. Now inside of there, it's a permanent uh, blank shooting attachment. So you can't shoot regular ammunition, nothing like that. It's got a blank shooting attachment permanently mounted in there. And look at this. Perfectly fits in there. It's stepped down to take the can and you can shoot cans. So if your buddy's like 300 yards away, he's like, hey man, I need a beer. You can just fire one over there. Okay, definitely don't do that guys, okay? Because you're gonna kill your friend, don't do that. But at any rate, cool little can launcher, uh, super cool little thing here. Uh, the other thing is it comes with this uh, golf ball launcher, you know, tube or whatever you wanna say. This golf ball does not wanna fit down in here. It's much harder to get the golf ball down in here much harder than it was for the uh, soda can. Here's the weird thing, that golf ball launcher tube, it just threads down inside of that tube for the can launcher. Anyway, there's the threads for the uh, golf ball launcher. So anyway, I kind of just wanted to share this with you guys. It was $299 on Global Ordnance. No affiliation with the company. Thought you might enjoy it. Have a good one.